hey what's up guys welcome back you're watching for today so we are reviewing lots of custom roms and their updates for oneplus 6 and 60. if you want to flash the under 14 roms from the scratch we already created video you can check that from the link given under the video description i am using the superior os extended 11th february build its review video is also available in the video description on the 4th of March, developer released the new update of this new series of ROM. I tried to download the update was stock OTA available under the system setting, but it's actually buggy. It's showing device update check failed like error. So I downloaded the update from the download link available at the developer's telegram challenge link. So today in this video, we are going to show you how you can update any Android 14 ROMs manually without data loss if your OT updater is not working. You can follow this tutorial over any Android 14 retrofit or non-retrofit ROMs. Flashing process is same. Tomorrow I will release in-depth review video of this new Superior OS extended update. Now without further ado, let's get started. On the new adventure. For updating your ROM, you need to download the full OTA package. I have given the link of new update. From there, you can download the new OTA. Your device USB debugging must be enabled under the developer setting. Now connect phone to the PC. Open new PowerShell window in the folder where you kept the OTA file. In the PowerShell window, now type ADB devices. On the phone, you will get the USB debugging prompt. Accept it. Now your device will be shown as an authorized device with the device ID in the PowerShell window. Now type the ADB reboot recovery and hit enter. This will boot your device into this recovery mode. You will see your device will boot to such stock recovery of ROM you are using. Now in the recovery tap apply update then tap apply update from the ADB. Now in the PowerShell window, type ADB side load and drag the full ROM zip file in the PowerShell window and hit enter. You will see the flashing process which start with the progress bar. On the phone, you will see this type of flashing process in the progress. At the 47%, you will see flashing got stuck in the PowerShell window. At this time, recovery will ask you to flash any new zip files. If you want to flash any new kernel, like kernels who supported by the primus or any kind of geos then you can flash them again if you want to do so then tap yes and flash that file same as you flash with the rom zip file is with the adp side load command but if you don't want to flash anything then tap no now in the cmd you will see one export notification means your flashing got done if you are first time flashing any android 14 rom then you need to format data using the format option in the recovery if you are updating, then just tap reboot to system. Phone will start, but it will reboot back one more time. But don't worry, your OS will boot back. So our device started to boot into the new updated version of Superior OS Extended. This is a new build dated 25th February 2024. I will release its full in-depth review by tomorrow. I will also add its video link in the description of this video. So this video is just for the complete tutorial for updating your Android 14 ROM. So next time you don't have to worry about how to update the ROM without working OT updater. So if you liked my work then please do like and share this video, subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for the notifications of our upcoming content of new custom ROM mods for OnePlus 6 and 60. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.